Hey YouTube, it's Dimitri, and today we're going to answer a subscriber's question. Um, Choi, I believe that's how you pronounce it. Sorry if I mispronounce it. Uh, they asked, I am a master's student in data science. My undergraduate degree is in computer science. I want to become a quant. Do I need to earn quantitative finance master's degree to become a quant? So it depends. It depends on what you want to do, and it depends on what you've actually learned in your data science master's and your computer science undergrad. Uh, so to start off with here, if anyone wants to end up in implementation, um, so implementation is using computer science to implement mathematical models into code, uh, and you optimize them for banks, trading funds, hedge funds, all that type of stuff. You can do that with an undergrad in computer science. So you can actually break in and work alongside quants, but again, I don't really consider them quants. You're just experts at computer science, right? You're a computer scientist. Um, now that being said, do you need a financial engineering degree, a quantitative finance degree to become a quant? No, you don't. There are different paths to get into this. Um, if you have a data science degree and you have a lot of statistical and mathematical rigor along with it. So data science degrees in general, there are some really, really good programs and there are some really, really terrible programs. This is the same of any degree. This is the same for quantitative finance. This is the same for financial engineering and all that, right? Um, if you have a really strong background in data science and statistics and math. Your math doesn't have to be super strong if you want to work in most quant jobs. It needs to be strong enough though. Um, but in general, if you have a strong statistics and data science degree, uh, go out there and look for banks who are hiring data scientists. Uh, a lot of times these will be called model development or they're looking for a data scientist to join a model development or model validation team. Um, you just get paid to build models. <laughs> That's what model developers do. Uh, model validators would be someone who would actually validate and check those models. Um, but do you need a quantitative finance master's? No. Um, if you have a strong background, you have a strong data science degree, again, this should be enough to break into the industry. It's not gonna be easy, even with either degree, uh, but having all the skills and knowledge in traditional statistics is a big plus because that's what a lot of the industry is currently using. And yes, a lot of banks now are hiring data scientists to kind of come and emerge into those teams. So if you have a computer science background, you've done some stats and data science, you should be in a pretty good position to break into the industry. Anyways, thanks for asking the question. For those of you watching, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you have more questions, put them in the comments below. And as always, until next time.